welcome back to my channel. If you're new here and you've never seen me before and you don't know who I am, I'm Shaylee and I make fashion videos here on YouTube. I do other videos too, but we've been doing a lot of fashion lately and today is no exception. I went to Target the other day. I asked you guys over Instagram what you wanted to see. I'm always asking you guys questions on there, so be sure to follow me. But I asked if you guys wanted to see an in the dressing room video or if you wanted to see more of like a haul video like I did with my last Walmart video, which I will link and the top and in the description box if you're interested in seeing that. But anyways, you guys voted that you wanted to see more of a haul video. So I went to Target, I got like 11 things, and I'm gonna try each item on and show you guys what it looks like on my body, and then also how much I bought it for. So I don't know about you guys, but I don't really consider Target to be inexpensive. I think it's a little bit more on the pricier side. Also, a frustration I have with them is just the fact that I don't think they're their plus size clothing is meant for plus size bodies. The Ava and Viv line I think is pretty good. Um, it definitely does more justice for the curves. But there are certain lines there, they have like bigger sizes, like 16, 18. It doesn't work. It does not work. And one of those lines is Wild Fable. I talked about this line in my Insta stories. I was pretty disappointed, but then it's funny because while I was checking out, I realized that several of the things that I actually bought are Wild Fable. So maybe a few things work and a few things don't. I don't know. Just in general, I don't feel like Target's the best for plus size clothing. And that's my opinion. I know there's a lot of you out there that agree with me. So if you do, let me know in the comments. Okay, so this is the first item. It's like this corduroy jumper zip up thing, I'm a jigger. And um, I really, really liked it when I tried it on in the store. Now that I'm seeing it on me after I've gotten home, I'm like, eh. I don't know, like I feel like it's one of those things, I could pass on it, you know, like I don't really necessarily need this and I'm not like in love with it or anything like that, but I do think it's really, really cute. It's kind of like a brick red color um, and it's very, very stretchy, which this was a surprise because this was part of the Wild Fable line. Um, and like I said, their clothes just are terrible, like they don't stretch at all. So I was very surprised by how stretchy this is, um, which is super nice and it's got some cute little pockets on the side here. Um, yeah, I don't know, you guys. I don't know. I'm trying to decide whether it's worth the money. Oh, I got a hair in my face. I hate when that happens. Um, it was $28, so it was a little bit more on the pricier side compared to what I'm used to because I like Walmart. But, I mean, it is super, super cute. And this is very in style right now. I actually saw one that looked almost exactly like this at Forever 21. The one at Forever 21, I think, was 22, so it was a little bit cheaper, but not that much. But yeah, I definitely think this is like a trendy thing right now, and I would wear it with some, oh my gosh, just ran to the wall. <sighs> I'm injuring myself in my own video. Okay, I would wear this with some black boots, probably, um, and you could even pair it with like a cute, puffy vest or jacket. There's a lot of different ways you could wear this. I think it's adorable. Is it worth $28? You guys let me know your thoughts. Guys, I feel like this next outfit is perfect for all the parties ahead. It's a cute way to do like a casual look, but still dress it up and make it nice and glam for the winter. So, I love this top. Velvet is back in style. Woo, 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 woo. Anybody else love velvet like I do? I know there's some of you guys that hate it too because I wore it a lot last year and you guys were like, all you wear is velvet. And I'm like, yeah, basically. Be prepared for December videos. It's gonna be all velvet. No, I'm not that bad, but I do love it. I think it is so, so cute. Um, so I found this like tank top shirt and it's $14.99. I got it in an extra, extra large. It's in this really pretty like berry color. So I just really, really like these pants, but now they're like feeling way tight. I'm like suffocating over here. I'm like, <laughs> I did just eat like a really big lunch, so that might be it. Um, these are the high rise jeans, the Denzen, Denizen, however you say that, Levi's. Um, they are a gray wash, as you can see. And these are size 18. And I really do love the fit on these. I think they're really comfortable. I just feel like this outfit would look really, really pretty with like a black jacket or a black cardigan, even my black faux leather jacket. Yeah. Let me know if you guys are velvet fans. I really am curious. Okay, so I wanted to keep these same pants on just because I think these pants are just cool looking pants. They make me look like a cool person. Anyway, this shirt, guys, oh my gosh, isn't it so pretty? It's wrinkled right now because it's been sitting in a bag for, you know, 
I don't know, five days. So I apologize, but this is what it looks like without the wrinkles. So it's a button up um, shirt and it does have this tie here to where you're able to tie it as high up as you wanna go, basically just adjust it to where, where it lies. And I really, really just love the color because it's like a mustard color. It's actually more of a gold than a mustard, I would say. But it is a really, really pretty color. And you can never go wrong with the mustard gray combination. Um, this was in a size 1X, and it's from the Ava and Viv line. Um, so obviously made for curves, very stretchy. I literally have no complaints about this shirt. I absolutely love it. I love it so much. Even when I have this top button buttoned, there's still no boob gap there. Um, so A++ for me. Why does Target place tags in the most awkward spots when you're trying to do a try-on video? Why? I threw over this distressed jean jacket. Oh my gosh, I love this thing. I love this thing. It's from Wild Fable. I mean, that's the line. It's from Target, but the line is Wild Fable. Um, as you can see, the arms are like cut out here, which is just really cute and trendy. It's just a really cool jacket. I don't know about it with this outfit. I'd probably wear it with some, either some leggings or black pants. Um, and I did buy some black pants. I'll show you guys in a second. I'll wear something with it. But um, I really do love this jacket. It's very, very roomy. Um, it's extra, extra large. It was $28. And by the way, this shirt was $24, I believe. Look how hipster this thing is. The pocketing contains 65% reprieve polyester fiber made from recycled plastic bottles. Yeah. This Wild Fable line is for hipsters, you guys. Like, how hipster do I look right now? That's not what hipsters do, it's okay. Let me know what you would wear this jean jacket with. I'm a huge fan of it. I think I'm definitely gonna keep this item. There's a few things that I bought that I'm like, mm, I don't know about that now, but this I feel like would go with anything. It would look bomb with black too. Like that black turtleneck, yes. So I kept the same pants on and I threw on this plaid top. I think this thing is so beautiful. So what's funny about it is it's part of the Isabel maternity line. So it is a maternity dress, which is why it has this thing, which kind of lies like right here. So like, if I were to wear this here like this and walk around, I would look pregnant. I'd be like, hello everybody. I have a 25 week old baby in here. But when you move it down, just a tad, this is just a helpful tip for those of you who want more maternity. Move it down just a tad. Bam, now it's accentuating the waist and it's not gonna make it look like you're pregnant. All that to say, I wear maternity shirts and maternity uh, dresses and things sometimes just because they're really comfortable and flowy, super soft and great thing to wear when you're gonna have a feast at Thanksgiving and you know, you're gonna eat a lot, just saying. But I really do love this top. I think it's super pretty. I love all the colors in it. Um, David's favorite one is this like red color right here. He's like, I love that red. It's an all-American red is what he called it. Um, and then this is more of like a dark maroon red. And then we have like some dark blue and the white. Um, so just a lot of really awesome colors that are all very bold. Like this is very much a standout type of shirt. It's such a fall shirt, but it's gonna transition into winter so effortlessly because of the colors. And then even like Valentine's Day. You could totally rock this on Valentine's Day. Oh, and then 4th of July. You could bring it back for 4th of July. You could just wear it all year. Just wear it all year, it's okay. So this was $29.99, and I believe I got it in an extra large. Okay, so this is a dress that's also from the Isabel maternity line and it was on clearance so I didn't get to really like try it on because I like grabbed it as I was running out of the store so I hadn't tried it on yet obviously there's a lot of going on here and there's no way to adjust it unless I got like a safety pin which is what I'd probably do um I because I really really like this dress look at the bottom isn't that so cute the ruffles and then it's got like it's kind of asymmetrical um, and all the colors, I mean, you got your mustards and your pinks and your reds and your browns and the dress itself is like a dark navy, almost even a black color. So I really do love the dress and I think it's like cute and flattering and form fitting. Um, and it's kind of spicy too. So once again, there's a tie here and instead of bringing it up here to make it look like I'm pregnant, bring it down a little bit and voila. 
Doesn't that make like such a big difference? Isn't that weird? I don't know. I just wanted to show you guys that. <laughs> it's just like a little trick I've learned through the years with, with maternity clothing. And this was $13.96 on clearance. And I got it in an extra large. So the next two items are sweaters. And I am a huge fan of this one. Why is there like a thing here? Once again, these have been laying in a bag in my car for like five days. So they have some weird dents to them. But this is like an oversized sweater. I believe I got it in an extra, extra large. Yes, it is an extra, extra large. It's by Universal Threads and it is $24.99. Totally worth it, you guys. I really, really like it. I can't remember if there was more colors, but I want to say that there is. I love how there's like ribbed material here on the bottom and then at the end of the sleeves. I think that is like so flattering and so very cute. The collar is super pretty. It's going to go with everything. And I paired it with these faux leather jeans. I just showed you guys a pair at Forever 21, I know, but these ones are also very, very soft and very, very nice. Um, and I really, really like them. And these are extra, extra large as well. And they are $16 and they're by the Wild Fable line. So there you go. There are some things by Wild Fable that are nice. So pairing the jean jacket over the sweater is like a very worship leader thing to do. If you know what I mean. If not, don't worry about it. You're not going to understand. <laughs> but um, anyways, yeah, I like this. I like this style together. Isn't this cute? Cute, cute. So Wild Fable, Wild Fable, Universal Threads. All right, and then there is this mega oversized <laughs> sweater. And I think the reason why it is so big is because once again, this is part of the Isabel maternity line. So, you know, you got to have room for the girl and baby bump. So even if my stomach was like out to here, look at that. That's how far it would come. So just so you guys know, just a heads up in case you're like pregnant at Target's maternity sweaters. I love it. It's really, really cute. It's like this emerald green color. I really like the sleeves. Oh, I love that, how it's just like, just naturally cuffed over. It is ribbed, as you can see, and it is very, very soft. It's just great, great quality. I am highly impressed with it, and I love it. So, yes, this was $29.99. And it is a size extra, extra large. Okay, and this cardigan is the very last item today from Target. Really super long, like comes all the way to my kneecap. So I love long cardigans. I know some of you guys love them too. Um, they are the best for fall. So they got these pockets right here, one on each side. Really, really roomy. This is a 1X and it is $29. 99 so even that price for like a cardigan I feel like is very inexpensive because you guys know cardigans can be pretty pricey um so I just threw back on that um mustardy shirt with it and I think it's very very cute but yes I wanted to just show you guys this cardigan if you're looking for a cardigan this is perfect and I know they have other colors too I just cannot remember for the life of me what the colors were. I'm going to show you guys this hat. I did not get this this time around. It's not going to go on my head because I have like a little bun in the back of my head. But I did wear this in my fall lookbook video. It's like this burnt orange hat. It's super, super cute. But I did get this at Target. These hairs, they won't get out of my face. So I will try to find the link for you guys and include it in the description box down below. Um, it doesn't tell me the brand on it. So that'll be interesting. But yeah, I actually got two hats from Target in the last like month or so. They have the cutest hats for fall, the cutest. So definitely go check out their hat section. All right guys, so that's all that I have to show you today. I hope that you enjoyed this Target haul. Definitely let me know if you did. I'm pleasantly surprised with the items that I found. I actually can't pick a favorite one. I have several in the running as my favorite. So definitely let me know your guys' favorite down below. And like I said earlier, if you are brand new to my channel, you've never been here before, I make videos three days a week, and most of the time it is fashion related. So be sure to subscribe on your way out so you don't miss it when I upload videos in the future. And a random question today, what color do people say looks the best on you? What color, when you wear it out in public, do people go, that's your color, you look great in that color. I would love to hear that. We will see you guys in our next video. Bye.